was home. When I first came to youth, though, I was homeless. I was living at the building that was just right next to it, next to you for building five pads. And it's not fun being homeless, but I was also was just driven. I wanted to be able to make something better of myself than just this. So I stand day, day by day at the train station asking people for some money so I can give myself something to eat. I saw myself 10 years in the future when I looked at somebody that had no teeth, smelly, and I had no real portion portion in their life to be able to go for something. I just saw that and I didn't want to be that. So when I heard about youth building, I went for it. And the field that we're in right now, age back, with your mind, work with your hands, and it's a great field to be into. And it's kind of sad that there's not going to be a lot of people around here that wants to do that. And you said yourself earlier today that people just want to be rock stars, singers, rappers, and all that. Just not everybody got that chance. So take something that you can do, something that's tangible. That's needed. Yes. And it's also needed. Instead of something that's like untangible, just think that, okay, it's easy. All you have to do is just do a little bit and then think you can get everything. Not life is, does not work like that. So, and I'm kind of glad that being a youth girl, I'm being able to succeed and still work my best and feel better for it. Because Knowing how much skill I place in, I know I can get that work right back. And I have a lot of skill and I wish to apply it.